I'm not in a spot right now that's real steady because uh, I've got nothing steady under my feet. But now I do. And this is a spot that I could stay for a very long time. What's the point? Well, I don't know about you guys, but for the last few weeks, I've felt like myself in this tree. Nothing solid under my feet. It's a place where I can't stay forever, forever. I don't think any of us can. We need our feet on something solid, somewhere where we can stay for a long time. And uh, boy, I was really encouraged as I read out of Psalm, verse 40, one through three, uh, a psalm that Pastor John shared. Check this out, Psalm 40, verse 1. I waited patiently for the Lord to help me, and he turned to me and heard my cry. He lifted me out of the pit of despair, out of the mud and the mire. He set my feet on solid ground and steadied me as I walked along. I was just encouraged there that, you know, hey, when we're patient and we cry out to the Lord, he hears us. He doesn't he doesn't want to leave us in this place of despair where our feet are just, ah, he wants to steady us. He'll set us on solid ground, but check this out. It's just not for our own comfort. Listen to this, verse three. He has given me a new song to sing, a hymn of praise to our God. Many will see what he has done and be amazed. They will put their trust in the Lord. You see, he steadies our feet so that others are drawn to him and encouraged by his power and his love. And I thought of this equation, these crazy times, plus us as followers of Jesus, allowing him to steady our feet equals others being drawn to him. I don't know about you, but that encourages my heart. Let's pray. God, thanks for this day. Thanks for a new week. And we just pray by your spirit, Jesus, as your followers, you would steady our feet. Keep us on solid ground. In your name, Jesus. Amen. Have a good week.